If you've got a need for speed, but you don't want to be talking to any drivers right now, Waymo is now testing the ability for some people to be able to go on the interstate while they're in a Waymo. If you're a Waymo rider, you may soon get to your destination a little faster. Waymo has done tens of millions of rides just in the Phoenix area alone, but those have been on side streets. Now they're testing out something new, being able to go on the interstate. That's where we are right now. Select riders now have the chance to ride on the highway in Phoenix, one of three cities where Waymo is rolling out the freeway feature. This is wild going this fast, knowing that no one's next to me driving. So how do people feel about going 70 miles an hour next to a driverless car? I would definitely jump on one. Yeah, I can it's do that. Hell. I can try. Many who have taken a Waymo. It feels pretty safe as well. Are ready to see it taken to the next level. Several people we talked to put more faith in technology than human drivers. But I probably think more of them than I think more of the average driver. I assume they're doing better at avoiding wrecks. There may be some data to back that up. The National Library of Medicine, the world's largest biomedical library, published a study last year using data from Waymo rides in Phoenix. It found human drivers had a crash rate five times higher than Waymo vehicles. So you wouldn't be scared? I'm not saying I wouldn't pucker up a little bit the first time. But not everyone is convinced. I think it's very dangerous, mm -hmm. especially on major highways. And we were going around a circle, we had the right of the way, and this Waymo was just coming right on through. Some say the technology simply isn't ready. There's a time and a place for everything, and I don't think we're ready for it now. Right now, Waymo is warning riders before their trip starts if their route will include highway driving. The freeway feature has not yet been rolled out to all riders. Hello. For ABC 15 Arizona. That was interesting. I'm Rachel Louise Just.